Hello! The tutorial you're about to watch is a part of a course called Arduino Zero to Hero. Link is in the first line of the description for much more, 52 lectures and everything you need to master Arduino. Hello and welcome! In this tutorial we're gonna create a glow-in-the-dark circuit using basically this, a light-dependent resistor. And we're gonna put it in a configuration with a transistor and a potentiometer and we're gonna have a voltage divider. Now the best way I can possibly explain this is with some images and it is genuinely tricky to explain. But we're gonna give it a go. So here you are, you are current and you're trying to get to Earth basically from plus to minus and this is what's gonna happen. By default let's assume this line is blocked, the transistor is off and the current is gonna flow this away and at this point it's gonna split. It is going to split and I guess I can call this into I1 and we're gonna call this I2. Now this is where the interesting thing happens. With this being a light dependent resistor, when you shade it, when it has less light, I1 goes up. And when you shine a light on it, the I2 goes up. So therefore, if you can get this guy turned to an amount where when this is shaded, I1 is such that this light goes on, um, you can achieve this equilibrium. So after we build it, we're gonna have to be adjusting this 10K. And if I'm right, we're gonna be in a state where um, the adjustments can make the light permanently on or even permanently off if we go all the way up to the 10K. So this should be interesting. Let's build it. Merge. Okay. So what are we gonna put into the breadboard first? I guess we can try with this transistor. And the transistor, get rid of you. So the transistor has the emitter, which is the top pin. It is connected through the variable resistor into the base. So if I was to like take one of the, I don't know, the base would be this pin right there. And if I was to, no, nope, wrong pin, base. Now I would need another little red one. some wires well Yep. So what we've got done so far, if I merge, so so far we've connected this line. So let's see what's next. Next we're gonna get the middle leg connected to the LDR connected to the minus. So, right now we've done this whole back end. So now we can connect the collector and the collector is gonna go through a resistor into the LED into the five volts. So the LED plus in the five volts right there, easy. 
collector right there. And last but not least, we just gotta connect the emitter into the minus. And this should be the easiest one yet. Okay. EVC. Aha. Uh -huh. This guy is one off. Let's see. Aha, there we are, off, always on, always see, always on, always off, and let's see if there's like a happy middle. Ha! Pretty easy to achieve, actually. So there is the sensor. In fact, maybe I can just move the camera a tad so you can see the sensor better. That's the sensor. Watch me shade it. Shade. In fact, I'm curious if something as thin as this wire, yeah, even putting a wire on top creates enough shade. And there you have it. A very easy to build, purely circuit based, glow in the dark circuit. Okay, see you in the next tutorial.